Korean Fighter X Periment or Indonesia Fighter X Periment KFX, IFX, is a fighter aircraft developed by Indonesia together with South Korea. This aircraft continues to experience progress and is ready to be produced a lot. This 4.5 generation multi-role aircraft is claimed to have the ability to exceed Eurofighter fighter aircraft made in England and F-18 made in the United States. Okay guys before we continue this interesting discussion, let's first subscribe Mr. Okim channel as support, and don't forget to activate the bell so that you will be the first person to get the next military video from me. This aircraft has a large deterrent effect in the region, exceeds Eurofighter and F-18. This is a future investment. The aircraft, which was developed since 2011, has entered the detailed design stage after the preliminary design review PDR, which is the determination of the final configuration of the fighter aircraft. So everything is clear. If there is a change, it is only a small part. Until now there are no obstacles in the manufacture of these fighter planes. Everything goes according to the stages and portions of each. Where Korea Aerospace Industries, high 80% while PT Gurgantara Indonesia, die, 20% in the supply of its components. Components made by PT Gurgantara Indonesia by 20%, namely wings, tail and so on. In fact, Indonesia if it has good qualifications might be more than 20%. For radar components that are still constrained by procurement, this is not a problem. Because the kite plans to find a radar provider from European countries, such as Italy and the United Kingdom, there is no problem and the assumption that this fighter will be left behind in terms of technology. Now we are at the stage of generation 4.5. In 2026, fighter aircraft are already in fifth generation, and we have taken a technological leap to a higher level, then we have no ability at all. If there are no obstacles, the fighter aircraft will start producing a lot in 2026, because it has received certification. So some components will be produced by other parties, including machinery, and avionics. Our engine uses American-made F-414. Navigation is produced by other parties that are integrated into this aircraft. The Director of Technology and Development of PT Di Marshal 1st TNI Gita Ampiriawan said, The KFX, IFX fighter is a 4.5 generation middle class multi-role fighter that is aerodynamically designed and has high maneuverability. This aircraft was designed to replace the Republic of Korea Air Force's fleet of the Republic of Korea, ROKAF, and the Indonesian Air Force. Some of the advantages possessed by KFX, IFX fighter aircraft, namely semi-stealth, semi-conformal missile launcher, advanced avionics, and water refueling. Although it was done in conjunction with KAI, the making of this aircraft was adjusted to the needs of the Indonesian Air Force as a user. The plan is that the Indonesian Air Force buys this aircraft for three squadrons or 48 aircraft. Unlike Korea, for the needs of the Indonesian Air Force, this aircraft will be equipped with a drag chute or an external parachute and tank. There are three stages in making this aircraft namely, the technology development phase or technology development phase for two years which resulted in the initial configuration of this fighter aircraft. Then the engineering manufacturing development phase and the prototype prototyping or prototype were finally mass produced. In Narwasita mentioned the importance of independence in making the main tool weapon systems of fighter aircraft. We have PT Durgantara Indonesia, we are working together to make our own combat aircraft. The target is that for 40 to 50 years we won't buy a plane in this class. This is a long-term investment that can be built by the sons and daughters of Indonesia as well as the deterrent effect for other countries. Ok guys that's the news about Korean Indonesia, if you think this video is important and useful, please share this video on your social media, so your friends know what you know, thank you for watching this video, don't forget to subscribe to Mr. Oking's channel for those who haven't, because subscribing is free guys, see you in the next video.